You're right there, YouTube. It is Krakoon again, bringing you another gameplay slash commentary, man. Obviously, we're on Call of Duty Black Ops still at the moment. We're going to be on Convoy using the gold G11. That's how it is. I'm going to bring some M16 gameplay very soon, so expect a lot forward to that. But first off, I've obviously got to get back to playing Black Ops because recently at the moment, I've probably been playing... Out of the games that I've been playing on my Xbox, I've, been, I've probably been playing Homefront more than uh, modern. Uh, what's the word now? Modern Call of Duty Black Ops. So I don't know. It'll be an interesting to see what's going on. And seriously, I'm gonna get this out at the start. And come, let me know in the comments below if you want to see some Homefront gameplay, some Homefront beastification. Let me know, yeah, because. Uh, I want to put out, I want to put out some Homefront gameplay, but I know it's my channel and I know it's my choice whether or not what the fuck I want to put on my channel. So if I wanted to do it proper badly, then I'd just do it. But because I'm a nice guy, uh, I thought I'd ask you if you actually want to see some Homefront. Because I'm not going to put it out and then none of you are going to watch it or what have you, but... I know Homefront games can usually last a little bit longer, but the TDM seems to be pretty short. You can usually get one of them done in about six minutes, if you're a beast like I am. But uh, let me know, yeah, because I'll do it definitely. If you want, if you want me, to, if you want to see some, that is. But anyway, as you didn't know, man, a lot of uh, some new news within the Call of Duty community recently. Uh, if you didn't know, now you know there's a new map pack being released, so this is going to be. Black Ops DLC number three, uh, number Trez, or whatever. I don't know why I said it. Trez. I think it's Uno Dos Trez. I don't know. Fucking hell. Uh, pretty much, man. There's gonna be a new map pack released. Four new multiplayer maps, another zombie map, and tell the honest truth, I'm fucking pissed off about the whole situation. It's fucking annoying, man. They should just include... They shouldn't, uh, they shouldn't fucking make us... As you see there, I hit that need off. As I always do. But, uh... Fucking... What was I going to say now? They should just include... They shouldn't... They should just in fucking include the map packs within the game. and shouldn't make you fucking pay for the bastard. Because... They should release it... It's staggered dates... As they're doing. But they should release it for free. Because... I don't know, man. 15 fucking... Well, it's like £10 English money. $15 US. Takes the fucking piss me, honestly. I can't fucking be arsed paying for it, but I know I'm going to end up paying for it. But anyway, enough of bitching about the map packs and that kind of shit, because... Oh, uh, they should just fucking do it for free. I mean, there's been free now. Free fucking map packs. I can understand if you did two map packs and then you make it pay for them. But there's been free map packs now and they're going to make us pay for it. And I can fucking guarantee you now, I'm not going to lie, I know, there's, I, I'm fucking going to put all my money on it. There's going to be a far fucking map pack. I guarantee there's going to be another map pack after this. Because the fucking money grabbing whores and people say, oh yeah, Battlefield 3 is going to take over Call of Duty community. With Call of Duty being able to release four DLCs, £10, $15, whatever, a fucking piece... Then people actually think Battlefield 3 is going to knock it off. Are you serious? I'm not saying that I'm a Call of Duty fanboy or anything like that. But for the sheer fact that they can get away with this. And nobody like really... Qu well obviously people question it. But it's still not going to make... Uh, it's still not, not going to make a difference. But the sheer fact that they can get away with this. And they think it's going to knock Battlefield out of the way. I think you're clearly mistaken. But anyway, onto the map scene. So I've taken up most of the commentary bitching about it. First map, there's going to be Hangar. Uh, it's going to be like a proper centralised map. It's going to be too big. I'm telling you this now. It's going to be too big and people are just going to hang around the centre of the map where the Hangar is. Uh, second map is going to be Silo. It's uh, some kind of fucking, I don't know, Russian nuclear missile silo base or some shit like that. I don't fucking care. It's fucking going to be boring as hell. There's going to be a lot of intricate connecting paths, but it's going to be fucking huge. And I don't know. It's pretty interesting, really. It's going to be absolutely huge. It's going to be like the jungle of the next map pack. 
and hangar's gonna be like the convoy of the fur like of the first of the next map pack. You understand? I'm comparing it to these map packs because they've all got a criteria that they've got to meet that like simulates like well balanced fair gameplay and all that kind of shit. Uh, the third one being driving. It's going to be like a small closed in type map. They're saying it's going to be like Newt Town. I'm telling you now, it's going to be like hotel. There's going to be camping bits like all around where people are going to choose to camp, but then there's going to be open areas where people can camp out onto these sight lines and get kills. Because that's just the way it fucking is. Uh, then the fourth, fourth one being hazard. Based on a World at War map where, I don't know, it's called Cliffside or something and pretty much they've based it on that and now it's going to be like a golf resort and it's going to be like the, uh, the oh what's the word now, it's going to be like the zoo pretty much of this map pack to that map pack. But as you see there, people's wrapping up the game, you know how it is, fucking 32 to 3. 11.33 KD, but nobody gives a shit about KD. But anyway, peace!